what is going on everybody my name is pete but you probably already knew that but in case you didn't you guys are watching the one and only paid to drive and pay to drive vlogs coming at you with another new video i hope you're all doing great out there let me know how you're feeling in the chat or the comments you having a good day you having a bad day let me know and if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you, my friend, should definitely be subscribed to this channel for free with all notifications turned on. Hit that free red subscribe button, turn on all notifications, and of course, don't forget to hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. So with that being said, my friends, um, got another video here where we're going to go over your feedback and your comments uh, in regards to this particular subject, of course, what you see in the title right here, where it's in regards to DoorDash paying out double digit base pay on advanced auto parts orders and certain ones like that, sometimes non-food related orders. Uh, in this case, it happened to be $20.75, which is unbelievably great. For base pay because like i've said so many times you cannot rely on customers tips you just can't you just can't because it just seems like it's a 50 50 someone's gonna tip or they're not gonna tip and if they do sometimes it's embarrassing like a dollar or two dollars or something like that you know you always want to hook up your your delivery drivers because again remember this is a premium service here okay so bob lease uh one of our loyal viewers said this hey pete hope you're having a great day there's a couple of times I've seen $15 payouts from a restaurant in my area. However, it was going a ways out of my zone and I didn't take it. Yeah, you gotta be careful with the ones that are long distance that are big payouts. They can fool you. When I dash, I usually take multiple things in consideration. Number one, the payout. Number two, the place I'm picking up. Number three, the distance. Definitely the top three that you should be paying attention to. I noticed the person sending you this went out of his zone. Makes me wonder how far he went. Even a $50 payout turns out to be nothing if you drive 60 miles to get it. Right, because if you're going out of your way, then that means you're not being paid for the ride back. So keep that in mind. Tom Perry Verwozo says, uh, I have to agree with Pete. I think that uh, what's happening is they're getting the order as if it was going to UPS or FedEx and somehow DoorDash acquires the order and gets the fee that would have gone to FedEx or UPS. Maybe, maybe. Uh, it's hard for me to believe that DoorDash would pay out that much because they pay us as little as they possibly can, as we all know. It's also odd to me because I would think that DoorDash would just take that money, not tell anybody anything and pay the driver the same low crappy fee. So I'm not sure about this one. I'd have to hear other people having the same circumstance to see what it really sounded like. But ha, obviously all of us would take a $20 base pay. Tom, definitely what you're saying makes a lot of sense. Uh, and I'm not sure about the UPS FedEx thing, but you never know. Uh, Maria Makanda, Makan, Mankata says, I just had a double stacked Walmart order today that paid out $20 and was about seven miles today total for three total small items. The customer only tipped $2 each and the others were $16 DoorDash base pay. All right. Also, look, if you notice another non-food related delivery, I'm starting to see a pattern here. Uh, Pam Lewis, another loyal viewer <clears throat> said, I think uh, non-food non orders should be at least 5 to $6 base pay or more. I, I would agree, Pam. I would even say even higher than that because it isn't food related. And the fact is it could be like a higher ticket item or something, something that could break. You know what I mean? So yeah, it's definitely a little bit more responsibility on the driver's part. Uh, Paper Bag Chronicles said, one of the most important factors is the city you dash in. I could not, could not agree with that more because again what have i always said what's the golden rule of the gig economy every market is different seriously guys learn it live it love it um greg burns says i've only seen base pay that high on mother's day 2020 every order that day base pay was around 20 bucks but that was way over a year ago yeah, I mean, I guess they were running some sort of a promotion, Greg, um, you know, on Mother's Day, so it's possible. Darcy Jones said, I think it is likely to do with the auto parts store that they had something to do with it rather than DoorDash having something to do with it. Also, could be possible. 
The thing is, because a lot of the non-food delivery orders are still fairly new, like they've only been around for like a year and they aren't as common as the restaurant, like the food delivery orders, we just don't know enough yet. But, you know, evidence is definitely pointing to a lot of these things. Thomas K said, hell yeah. Nancy Perrier says, uh, I see really high base pay from DoorDash when there's a lot of mileage. Interesting. I work nights and sometimes they need something to be picked up that's really far from where I am and the delivery is also far. Right. I wish we knew what the mileage was on that particular order that got the $20.75. So what do we think about this high base pay? Do you think it is mileage related? Do you think it's something else related? Or do you think it's, and do you think it's because it's non-food delivery? I think all of those are important factors. So let me know your thoughts down below in the comments or the chat over there. And if you guys ever want to send me anything for a video or just have a question, send me an email, paid to drive stories at gmail.com. Or for a quicker response, you can message me through Patreon at patreon.com slash paid to drive. That link is in the description or the pin top comment if you'd like to sign up. And anyone who signs up, I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos, which I'm about to do right now. So uh, when you hear your name called in the chat or the comments, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. We've got the very generous Ari Rosenbaum, $100 ultimate driver every month. Ari, thank you so much for your generosity. And of course, the very generous Samantha Michaels, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Ivan Jerome Gilroy, Joe Valerio, Angela Counts McCarty, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreau, Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Lawrence Brown, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Haviland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah. Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Hine, Brian Richardson, Kenny Bess, Ginny Thomas, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and of course, Valerie Brown. So huge shout outs to all of you. I really, really appreciate every single one of you. So yeah, if you want to sign up, links in the description down below. Also, also, the bottom of the description is the link for the free gas app called Get Upside. I talk about it every day for good reason, because you could be saving money every time you pump gas at the gas pump. So download it for free. Links in the bottom of the description. Go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside gas app. And within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every Every time they pump gas, it's called Get Upside. Links in the description. Make sure to download it today, my friends. That's right. And of course, if you want one of these awesome Live to Drive, Drive to Live t-shirts, you can get your own at paytodrivestore.com. Everything is on sale every single day. Lots of different designs, sizes, colors, you name it. We probably have it at paytodrivestore.com for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies. Links in the description or the pinned top comment, as always. And if you made it to the end of this video, simply leave a comment saying END535, E-N-D 535. Just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And of course, hit that like button down below if you haven't yet. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. So I'll give you a second to do that. Thank you so much. And until next time, get that money get that honey keep hustling and keep bustling and we'll see you next time right here on paid to drive and pay to drive vlogs that's right everybody and as always drive safe be well and we'll see you on the next one peace